Welcome to Sheni Vachamishi. It's a sunset. Gimel Thomas begins right now. We're going to start with the story of the Rebbe. I'd like to thank Usher Klein for inspiring me to make the hachanis for Gimel Tammuz. And we're going to get a story that's going to be about the Rebbe that fits for the sophisticated Litvak and the reformed Jew about leadership and for the Chesidah that likes the ecstasy, something like explosive of, of, of a Rebbe of uh, unprecedented, a Rebbe of a kind that never has been seen in the history of Rebbe's or Hasidism. I'd like to make a L'chaim for the Rebbe and for Usher Klein in Australia. L'chaim, Baruch Atah Adinah Yilam Ha'chaim Shahakal Niyah B'dvarei. Uh, for the hachanis that you inspired and for the for bringing beautiful story uh, Rabbi Shays Taub stands in South Africa in front of a bunch of students at a, at a Sinai Abada forum some sponsored program for scholars and he tells the story of the Rebbe the Rebbe was very non-orthodox that even label Groner couldn't handle the truth that the Rebbe would say and even Chaim Baruch had to censor things that would go through on the camera and Rabbi Sheis Tab, of course he tells over the censored story a student he is becoming Frum he has a, 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 a shiksa in his life that he loves you have to understand the reason why in modern times we have intermarriage back in the day when we lived in caves we didn't have that is because of the beautiful technology and invention of the 747s carrying Yidden from Tel Aviv to Cupertino, California. So a boy comes from, from Tel Aviv and his name is Yehuda Gul Al Yeh, an Ashkenazi who gets the job right away. And this elite Ashkenazi meets a, a girl, her name is Risa Kobayashi. And they're like minded in every way. And then Gul Al Yeh. Just like the bingo, when you turn all the little balls and peas and finally one falls in the cup, it goes Rosh Hashanah, Hanukkah, are you Jewish? You're from Israel? Purim, Shavuos, Nachayim Kippur, finally, after two, three years, one pea falls in, the Pintaliad pops out and he says, I'm becoming from. And he goes to the Rebbe, as Rabbi Sheis Taub says, and he pours out his guts to the Rebbe and he says, Rebbe, this is my situation, what do I do? And the Rebbe says, I envy you. I, n I don't have your Nisayan. I could barely take a walk with the Rebbe and with my wife. I could barely spend time with my wife that halacha requires. Rebbe Chaim Vital writes in his book that his wedding was postponed. Inevitably, he was nichshel in Eitzas Zedel of Atala many times, he says. Inevitably, from the few months that his wedding was postponed. The Rebbe doesn't have time to be a regular yid that has to go. He says, you at least you have a, a, a girl that you love, that, you're, that your relationship is working. It's maybe, according to some mystics and, and, and Kabbalah, that they say it's considered shifcha, nida, zaina, the nachshaz, all these Rosh Tevis. By the time you put four letters together, you could scare somebody. The Rebbe looks at him and says, Halavai, I had your situation. I'm nichshul in the worst of Adis regularly. I'm so busy taking over the world, spreading my name everywhere. And Groner was shocked, but the Rebbe wasn't afraid. The Rebbe, ain't, the Rebbe, when he said the truth, he said it like no Rebbe in history. He was an unprecedented Rebbe, very unorthodox. He would say it like it is. I'm so schmutzig. And you're coming here and you have a girl that loves you? I don't have your level. I'm in the tough, tough shari tumah. L'chaim, the Rebbe's inspiration should come to each and one of us to say the truth just as it is. Here's the beautiful sunset of Gimel Tamas. How was your Shabbos? Did you have on the Shabbos before Gimel Tamas? Did you have your Aliyah? And what other hachanas have you got planned? Yudah Chatzkelevich, me and the Bianco person are waiting to go into the AO. We want to know where you are. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah
Das ist das same thing as Mitzoytes. Just like Avak comes off a bigger solid piece, so Mitzoytes come off a bigger oil. It's the same thing. That's what Rashi says. That they were Maila Avak at the Kisar Kobe because that's exactly what the fight is about. Are we going to be Maila and Mitzoytes or not? How long does the fight continue between Edom and and uh, and Yaakov? Till so the morning. I don't know. Sasha. I don't know. Sasha. The Medrash says. But now, Alois Hashachar is not yet day. That's the mistake. Everybody thinks Alois. What, what time is Alois Hashachar? Alois Hashachar is before Netzach Hama. It's not yet day. <laughs> <laughs> in the summer, it's, it's after Alois HaShachar, right? Alois HaShachar is not yet day. That's the mistake everybody made. Everybody thinks 